Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another awesome Early Access episode of Star Wars Battlefront 2 multiplayer gameplay. Today we're taking to the skies and showing off some of the flying vehicles available in Star Wars Battlefront 2 and some of their abilities. Thank you to EA for sponsoring this video. I'm going to lock on to a enemy pilot and hit him with my laser missile and do significant damage, but now I have a enemy pilot trailing me, so I have to use my agility ability Go into first person perspective to get a better lay of the land. Look directly at the ground. And I just got to say, one thing I really like about flying the vulture droids and all the vehicles available in the early access build that I got to play on is the nimbleness. And you see right there, going that's a sick shot, just going, dipping down to the city streets and losing my pursuer. You're so nimble. You have two options. You can move with the mouse pad uh, very accurately and fluently and, and very fast and also you can press the a and the d key at least on pc uh to do a barrel roll and you can co combine those to be very agile and then i'm going to use my final ability taking out stone mountain and then i get taken out i really like that third ability that i used it's a barrage of laser beams it kind of reminds me I believe the, it's a warthog or warthog. Uh, it's a plane in real life that just has this massive machine gun on it and it flies down. It's like a jet and then it just l lays out like 5,000 bullets in a matter of like two seconds. That really feels like uh, the main ability on uh, the Vulture droid in particular, uh, which I got a lot of experience with. And I think a lot of people are interested in this uh, flying gameplay. I did a video on Battlefield 1 showing off the plane and it got over 1 million views and I think that's what really started uh, to turn around my channel and that was a big video. And we're doing a giveaway of Star Wars Battlefront 2 to possibly get your free copy of Battlefront 2 on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, or PC. Comment down below what system you would prefer and what was your favorite vehicle. We featured every single flying vehicle available in the build that I played. We used the V-Wing right now. A little bit later, we have the Starfighter, which is probably the best vehicle, and it has one of the coolest abilities in the game, and it just looks pretty cool. And earlier, we were using the Droid Vulture. So, leave a like, comment down below, and be subscribed to my YouTube channel because we have a bunch of Star Wars Battlefront 2 gameplay still to upload. I'm showing you guys everything that I could. A lot of people might be wondering, how do you get into the planes? I'm going to call them planes, flying vehicles. And you get into the planes by accumulating battle points. How do you get battle points? By helping your team out. That could be by killing somebody. As many points of damage that you inflict on an enemy, you get those equivalent in battle points. Say you damage me for 75 damage, which is half health. That's going to give you 75 battle points. If you play the objective, you get battle points. If you help your team out, you get battle points, basically. So play the game. And I really like this feature and how they did it because there's a lot of people who don't fly at all. There's some people who exclusively pilot. So this is a good way uh, to really kind of play your role. And once you get into a plane, to be honest, if you're a good pilot, you're going to accumulate damage to get more battle points and always be able to spawn into a plane if there's one available. You can only have three out at a time max. And that was on one team. I think the other team can only have two. So there's a balancing issue. You can't have, uh, you know, 10 planes in the sky on this particular game type. I'm sure in the future there's gotta be space battles and just aircraft. And uh, that was in Battlefront 1, so there's three times as much content in Battlefront 2, so I'm assuming they're going to have it. Um, I don't know, I haven't seen anything, but I think it's they already announced it. Anyways, so you uh, can actually get into the pilot seat, and if you do really good, uh, you can rack up a bunch of battle points, because you do a lot of damage, and you're helping your team out a lot if you're an effective pilot using some of the abilities, and then you can possibly get a more expensive vehicle or a hero or a champion uh, by just racking up battle points in the sky. So thank you guys for watching this video. Subscribe for more Battlefront 2. I appreciate you.
and I'll see you later. Bye.